If you are trying to beat the heat by book, booking a lawn care service, you might be out of luck for the next couple of days. Lawn companies across Madison County tell us they are getting so many calls, they are having to turn people away. Way 31 Sierra Phillips is live to show us how the heat is big business. Sierra. Pushing a lawnmower like this one is probably the exact opposite of many of you, of what many of you at home want to do today. But lawn care workers tell me that's exactly why their phones are ringing off the hook. But they tell me they're keeping an eye on their employees and making sure they don't overheat. You stop sweating. You stop start getting stomach cramps. You maybe start getting a little dizzy. That's what Ron Gothart from Ron's Mobile Lawn Service says he felt when heat exhaustion hit him one sunny day while working outside. Once you get overheated and get sick or get nauseated, you went too far. And when you go too far, it's hard to recover back. He says that means his workers have to take it slow. But it's hard to do that when more and more people don't want to mow their own lawns in the heat. I've had to turn people away. I've actually turned two, two away today. Gothart isn't alone. I called more than a dozen lawn care companies today. The ones that got back to me said they've had to either turn away new clients or reschedule appointments because of the heat. Business is good, but it's hot. You've got to take care of yourself. Gothart says he tries to drink water, wear sunscreen, take breaks, and wear a hat. He says his wife calls him every four hours to make sure he's doing just that. I wear sunscreen and a big hat, and I don't have my hat on today, so I'll be in trouble. The heat also isn't going unnoticed by their clients. Just while I was out today, three separate people offered me water. Reporting live in Madison County, Sierra Phillips, Way 31 News.